What's going hey on, guys. people? It is Scotch Four Dummies. We are live. It's, it's snowing. Happy Thursday. It is snowing. It is Thursday. It's snowing. Thursday. I don't feel cold in here. Oh, it's, for Pete's it's, sake! It's <laughs> what? It, oh my goodness! No, no chance. Is there anybody in here already? I think it's is there, are we live? I Hello. I hope no. this Hello. Tap, tap tap. This thing working? Exactly. <laughs> 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 go ahead and tap that. See if Drew freaks out. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't do that, All right? We've already Hopefully the audio and video is working tonight. Uh, we we kind of calmed down a little bit. We had some technical difficulties before we, the show started, but we should be good now. It's almost like every week. It is. Yeah, I, not well. to mention, I was here an hour and a half early, and Drew had everything set up. I mean, all kinds of new bells and whistles. And then 10 minutes before we go live, boom, the audio goes out. <laughs> uh, the fun part of streaming, live streaming, let me tell you, it's never completely straightforward easy. No, it's it not. It really isn't. No, it feels like it to me. <laughs> Amen to that. As soon as you get ready, for you punks. As soon as you get ready to start, Windows updates. <laughs> yeah. I'll hit the button on that. <laughs> there feels, yeah, there is a hole in my roof. Snow is coming out. Let's see who's online real quick, Mark. What's going All on? right, so let's we go. Oh, I see a PGWC hey, guy. Yeah, you do. Ronan, Ronan uh, happy belated birthday to that guy. Um, we do have your birthday samples poured and will be probably shipped up Holy tomorrow. Holy smokes. Um, so Tom oh, R, which Tom R has already started putting a certain comment. Well, I think he's kind of waiting for something to happen. Bob we'll H get started too. that in a second. Did Bob H do it too? I see Bobby J, Francois, Brian, Brandon, Nurse Dave's man, keep going. Martin, Jeff, everyone saw him a few seconds ago. Uh, Bliss at 13. Hello, gents. Hey, what's going on? Bring a 129. Lots of new names too. I know. Man, I, love awesome. I love it. I love it. A lot of new names. I see Richie Z, yeah. Bryce. Uh, it's our music. They're using our music. on before. I gotta get comfortable here. So, so he's 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 down under. Yeah, Always yeah, good to see him. Richie Z, the Dram Tram. The Dram Tram. Yeah, we got all kinds of guys tonight. Jason Carroll. You know, I see Bree, but I don't see it's Michael Sunday is not going to be with us tonight. He's what? got, he may be at the very end, but Bree's in his place, so he's Well, we'll spirit. take that. We got the better half of uh, that, Dale. Uh, no, 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 nice, I got nice, Chad, nice. Uh, Chad's there, Justin. Justin oh, just man. made it. Cole. One eye on World of Warcraft. Ah, check out. Wait, 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 wait. Cohen's not happy with my number one pick. Oh. oh. Dun, dun, dun. And he claims to be a people. Uh, <laughs> well, that, hey, that, look at that. Craig S. picked up Spay Fumare. Oh, he yes. He just already. Isn't that a great find? Yes, that's great. Dude. Didn't that get our bottle of the year last it year? It did. That's why I'm excited I, that somebody grabbed a hold of I it. I have to say, one of my major disappointments with 2020 is not being able to go to that distillery. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. How we kidding. had it lined we up. Not open to the public. We were going to get the red carpet treatment with, you know, 20 of our subscribers. Man, we were going to have a time. Let's pray to God 2021 is a little more uh, sympathetic to us. Hopefully the audio is okay. I saw a, a, a comment about the audio is still a little funky. Hopefully it's okay, so I'm not sure what that the means. The raffle brings all the boys to the yard. <laughs> <laughs> you said that. 
Thursday. Yeah. Yeah. yeah this is a special night because this is our last live of 2020. And we, got two, and we got two cards left. So do your math. If it's the last show and we have two gift Are cards. Are we doing two tonight? I don't see why not. All right, let's, let's do, do it. it. All right. I'm going to double down, right. boys. Let me get that set up where you guys All talk right. about what's Justin, going on Justin with... Justin's audio skips, too. So, yeah, we're going to do one now, and then we're going to start another one to yeah, no, end the show so and say goodnight for 2020. So... Let me turn the snow off. Maybe that's causing the problem. Um, what is it? Exclamation point raffle. Yes. Once Drew gets it started, you'll know. And in the meantime, let's talk about this dude. This and your special guest. Let's talk about this hoe. Yeah. <laughs> What'd you say? It says ho. It says ho on my shirt. But look, it lights up. Aw, isn't that cute? So I'm extra, Classy. I'm extra hoey, I guess. Is Excellent. <laughs> so yeah, it, um, this week I released my top five. Had a special guest, Dr. Scotch. Had a great time talking to him. You saw on the video we were, you know, we didn't want to get too close because it's wrong and everything. But and then and then he took the he took your bottle of Lager 16. I, it was your bottle. Oh, son <laughs> of a gun! It's, it is it's gone. gone. He took your bottle. <laughs> It was his bottle. That's why he ended He's up. no dummy. <laughs> I, I got a pour out of it, but he took the whole bottle. So yes, uh, my my top five. I, you know, good good whiskeys, but you know what? Yeah, I had I a think couple. Snow was causing it. So I had a couple re reviews, and because those re reviews were that good, they were worthy of going in my top twenty. Okay, I mean, well let's let's 16. run it down because I, I actually liked the fact that you kind of worked your honorable mentions into the the five instead of mm -hmm. doing them up front. You switched up your format just a little bit, yep. and that was fun to see. But let, let's talk about what the five were and what the honorable mentions were. So for those of you that didn't see the review, oh boy, what were they? Got to remember them now. Uh, my honorable mentions <laughs> no were sure. uh, Kill Karen, and um, what was my other honorable mention? Oh, isn't the Art Bag? Um... Ugadale? Ugadale, yes. Yeah. So those are my honorable mentions. My number one, uh, my number five, uh, Bladnock. Bladnock 15, Adela? No, it was the. Um, <laughs> oh my God. The Gun Scotia. It was the Victoriana. We had the Victoriana, the Bladnock, and then Log 16. Those are my five, four, three. We had okay. the two honorable mentions, and then we had the Corey Vrecken and the Dalmore. The King. Dalmore King Alexander. Out of nowhere. Gosh, yes, it uh, is. that reminds me, I forgot to call that liquor store again today. Two days in a row, I didn't have time to call a liquor store to see if they would ship to Indiana. I found that Dalmore King Alexander for $2.29. That's a pretty good deal. Porting hands? I didn't pour it in my hand. I'm drinking out the uh, bottle for that. Yeah. Yeah. The table, $2.29, like it's, it's not a bad price for that. $300 is a little high, but $2.29, $200, that, if you can that, get it in that, that range, right. it's really more worth it. It's something to try. You so, know, I was talking to uh, one of our, our subscribers, our, our big fans out in New Jersey, not to name any names, oh, yeah. Bobby. Um, <laughs> and, you know, he just he says he just can't get it because yep. he doesn't understand that whiskey for that price and at, at 40 ABV. Yep. And I said, oh, it's it's time to, to bring you back down from the cask strength mm -hmm. and get you appreciating some nuance in scotch, some complexity and some layering, you know, because honestly... It's got it all there. Yeah, it'd be better if it were 48. <laughs> I mean, everything's better at 48, right? But well, I don't know if it would be, though, because so there's so much. I think he's absolutely right. There's so much nuance in that whiskey that if you had this huge, overpowering yes. alcohol content, you'd lose it all. He's absolutely right. You'd burn right. out your palate. 100%. You can't do that. To me, what that whiskey 100%. is, is when a master blender waters down and gets everything at the same level so they can figure out the yep. blend, so they can get everything just right. To me, that's that. Yes, right? that's exactly like, what he did. They, they've got it at 40, and they are blending it to perfection. Like, don't touch this. Do not, do do not. yeah. Do not bring Put it up. Put that salt and pepper down. 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 You don't right. need any. Exactly. Don't need but on, on, on that note, I mean, I it, it is hard. If, you, if oh. you're all you're drinking is cast strength Bryce, whiskey. What? Bryce bought a King Alexander after the review. Totally, totally worth it. it. Yes. <laughs> it, I think Andrew is 100% right. It's, it's a perfect... Balance at forty. I, I think you're you're gonna get masking with ABV if you have a higher ABV. Although we all love it, and it'd be, it'd be nice if you could have higher ABV and play with it somewhere. No, but I, I think it's a perfect balance the way it you, is. You kill some of the flavors. I think. I, th I think. Well, right. some of the flavors are and very subtle. subtle. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. See, that's the thing that's about that bottle. Yeah, it's forty ABV. It's just it's just got this unique conditions. All the conditions are right for that that bottling. You do it different, do it differently. It would be wrong. Right? And for those that you want to know about the dog, the stag on that bottle, become a patron and find out that story. Oh my gosh, I, I forgot mean, about we, that. We do know where that stag came from, and the, the 
trials and tribulations that it went through. If you're a patron and you have not seen the behind the you, scenes video of Mark, you totally owe it to yourself. I, I got send it. it to you because it's thirty minutes you will love and appreciate. It's You'll great. go buy a bottle of King Alex. <laughs> Guaranteed. But um, Mark, you you talked about this a lot, and I, I'm right there with you. It's it's a kind of a roller coaster ride of where we've gone in our journey of Scotch. We, you can talk about Pete and everything else, but really, let's talk about ABB just for a quick second before we get into this high ABB yeah. bomb shootout. We have gone down the road. I think we all love and appreciate higher ABV because it's more wiggle room. You can have. But where do we start? Room. But we started low. No, oh, yeah. I like everybody does. Like everybody else does. But what's, what I really like right now is I am with you. I am, a, and to your point on the and King Alexander, I really appreciate some of the lower ABVs because, y yes, they're more subtle, but sometimes I like to be able to have this subtle. It's not as high ABV. You don't have to fight it as much. And you can. Oh, is that Molly? It is Molly. I hear Molly. Oh, oh Molly is not back, Andrews. Thanks, bro. Thanks, Christmas, exactly. man. You're going to pour something. Yeah, so, so keep in mind, guys, the um, the raffle that's going on now, that will end about 30 minutes in, and there will be another raffle after that. So hang in there. After, when we choose the first one, then you can re-enter for the second Ooh, card. Right. Both cards are not being given away on this specific raffle. Right. So we'll do we'll draw one at the half hour show, a half hour mark, and then we'll start oh. another raffle. You'll have to enter again. And uh, and and pull the last one as we get ready to shut I know down. Where you get some more. I I don't know this this that's a lot there. I, we could probably kill it, but it's going to take a lot. For yeah, us we to got all these to go through. It's but, a lot to but before we get to the um, the shootout, Doctor Scotch did leave Is something. This, did you been drinking on? Uh, not no, it's poured out. I just want to quit. He did okay. leave something for the Scotch for Dummies. Now oh, he, he put a, a sample logo, but I you must have a list because it's, it's Scoth. Is it the cipher? Doctor Scoth. So it was weird. Doctor Scoth. Um, so I will have some the hell of do open that. All right. For the Dr. Scotch about that. For Let's move the other way for a second. second. This is exciting. Do we it is. I hope Scotch. we got his lab coats. Is it like a big... Who <laughs> <laughs> lab coat? <laughs> that would be awesome. A bunch of beakers. It's, beaker. a it's a button with a lab coat on it. <laughs> it's pizza. No, it's not. It's, it's a shoebox. It's, it's from the USPS. <laughs> hey, not from the Netherlands? No, no. Not, <laughs> not, not from the. Oh, too soon. Oh, too soon. <laughs> Sorry, Mark. Yeah. I cut. Very I soon. Cuts like uh, a knife. Uh oh. Got black boxes. All right. Packing peanuts, go. Right? Oh, a little Glen Karen, huh? Oh. Oh, it's a shoe. Pinky toe. Pinky toe. I knew that was going to uh, happen. But I don't think these are just your normal Glen Karens. That sounds like a lot of packing peanuts. There's a man. lot of peanuts in this thing. Peanut for me? Just a little. Oh, wait a minute. First things first, it's got a cool little glass lid. Oh! It's a copa <laughs> glass. <laughs> really? Ah. Ah. Dr. Scott has good taste. So I, I understand a lot of people like these glasses for nosing whiskey. Well, you know what? Let's see what it's like. I like the lid. Oh, the it has a lid. The is special. I've been wanting one with a, with a glass topper. You see these guys online. Oh, it just kind of looks classic. Oh, hat. Slick, man. Fancy. Well, well Don't mind uh, if I do. I don't do you know. Know. Now, this, now this, this rage raises us to a snobby level. You have a great poop on. I don't know if we're fancy enough for this, You know what? Man. I take out back all the things I said about Dr. Scott. He's a eye. Thank He's you, Dr. Scott. He's a eye. All right, cool. Very That's cool. That's pretty cool. So... You know what? Maybe we'll have a celebratory need some 20 in this tonight. Oh, that's nice. Nice. All right, I'm down. Can we do that now? <laughs> <laughs> we got some whiskey to drink. Should have got the big glasses. Know, the so, cover. everybody, uh, exclamation point raffle to make sure that you guys are entered in this raffle. Uh, don't want to miss out. We've got two of those cards to yep, give away. Yeah, we're going to do one in 20 form? minutes, right. one at the end of the show. So, um, you know what? Give me a little bit of that Glenn going just so I can have something on the side while we talk about what we're getting ready to do. So, we actually put, I think it was... 12 bottles up amongst our bars at Scotch and Dummy um, and kind of no, arranged the them in different arrangements. Them and then we put so it out know. there. How yeah. many? Who did, we, sticker on. Right there. who did we put the, uh, the, Just do this to the patrons? patrons. So our patrons right, kind of chose we that we were going to do this set first. Um, I don't even remember what's in it. It's not labeled. I believe there is an SMWS Glen Scotia. There is a Lafroy Carches. Fino, Fino uh, cask, yep. Fino cask. There's an Ardbeg, uh, no, Corey Vrakken. Vrakken, and the last one is the SMWS. Oh, SMWS. SMWS Buna Haben. Yeah. It's a Buna Haben SMWS. So, 
Yeah, there's here's, one. here's the Bunahaven. You, you want to do a close up? Western Wanderer, which is 10. Be close up to that camera. You see it? There it is. If we can get uh, the, the glare, is just killing it. There All we right. go. Anyway, 10.167 Western Wanderer is 59.5% ABV. Obviously, it's not peated according to the yeah, SMWS profile. Interesting. It might stick out. We got charcoal in a honey pot. 93.119 Glen Scotia. Yeah. Uh, aromas of burning cinnamon sticks and charred marshmallows. Okay. Join burnt heather, salted chocolate, and bananas on a barbecue. Banana, ooh, and that's banana a lightly foster. peated profile. Now, if I don't find bananas, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> <laughs> so the other two that we've got are the Lafroy Carches Fino, yep. which is what? What's the ABV on that? 51.1. 51.1. And then the final bottle is the Ardbeg. Corey, Corey yep. Reckon, which, which is arguably very close to one of my favorite art bag. It's a pretty tight yeah. shootout. That 20 something was. Uh... Oh, well, yeah, if you want to spend 550 bucks. <laughs> Not on my money. Not on my money. <laughs> um, but it was good. So, what we're going to do. By the way, that Corey Reckon was on my top five. So. It was. We've got, we've got them blind. We don't know what's what. We've got them all labeled out. These guys are pouring them out. Um, and we're going to go through them. What are we going to end up doing here, guys? Are we picking a winner? Yes. Are we just ranking? Are we... Yes. We're obviously talking through them. We're going to nose, taste. Yep. Um, oh, I'd say rank. Yeah, we're going to rank them now. Yeah, this is tonight on a idle uh, Thursday night in December 2020. We'll see what we'd like tonight. It may be different next time. Hang so, on a second while you get that ready. So we poured... I poured all of these into these bottles, just like we did our top 10 shootout we did right underneath here is the label so we have no idea we mixed them up and we just completely put dots random dots on them and we matched them up with our glasses so there's no way no one knows anything about these they're all pre-poured ready to go the one thing i will say is that you need one in yellow the yellow gotcha Fill it up. is the abvs on these guys are going to kick us in the butt they're all the 50s plus right so that's what i was going to say how how did we determine this subgroup out of all the 12 bottles or whatever we, we all four chimed in and said, looked at the ABVs, because if you do them so far apart, one really sticks yeah. out. Um, it's we hard to compare them. Yeah, so there, there might be one that sticks out in here because of that, that boonie's not peated. So that one's it's not? I don't think it is. Why did we, why did we do a non peated Yeah, they want us to rank them. Well, we, yeah. want, to, we want to throw it off, because sometimes well, We're going to know what that one is. Maybe, maybe peated. not. And and you're gonna find but out. here's the other thing, we, we also polled our patrons. So we, we put together, what, five five groups? Four. 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 That was five, it was four? Four groups of four. Okay. Right? Well, that'd be wow, 16 bottles. Hell, lines. we ain't got our act together. Anyway, <laughs> we polled our patrons to pick the best combos, <laughs> and this this combo won overall by, I think it was like 12 or 13 votes or something like that. So this is what we went with. So, so, so what order do we want to do? Blue? We'll follow Andrew. So blue, blue red, red, green, green yellow. and yellow. All right, I can do that. So color-wise, they they're about the same. About the uh, same. The last yellow's a little lighter. Red and yellow are lighter. Green's a little darker. Green's a little darker. Um, green is definitely darker. So we are going to rank these. It, it, so if, if that's the the primary goal here, I don't care so much about <coughs> guessing what it is. Nope. We, we may be able right. to pull that off or get light, but at the end of the day, it's about ranking here. Yep. All right, so nose, palate, ABV. ABV should be close anyway. Yeah. We were close. We tried to do that. So. Took the variable out. Right. So, eeny, meeny, miny, go. Blue, right? You want to check blue? out our comments? So you guys blue. ready? Let's do it. All right. The blue. All right. All right. Get my game wow. face on. Not much peat on the nose. No, there's not peat on that. <laughs> it's because it's the Boone Hop. It probably is. No, oddly enough, I, I, it's it's got a brine. There's a briny quality to it. Yep. Almost juicy fruit. Ooh. Yep. Juicy fruit. That is, God, Drew, you and your, you pull, man. There's a lightly peated note on there. You don't get that at all? Yeah, Not I yet. do. Definitely get that brine, but there's some peat into it. Um, mm. Ooh, that's nice. Mm. So tell me about a pheno cask. Why are you looking at me? Because it's wine. Pheno's a type of sherry. Pheno's a type of it's sherry. It's a sherry right. cask. Because it's, it's a wine. <laughs> and I look at you for wine. It's a less, less oxidized Please sherry. Please help me. <laughs> I do not know. Mm. Dude, that's it really has nice. A, it has a, a hint of like um, stale cola. 
on the nose. Maybe. You taste I'm getting like I'm getting like cedar. I think cedar wood on it. Mmm. <laughs> mm. mm. That's nice. Wow. Musty. Oh, there's the peat and smoke. Oh yeah. Um, no, it's there. Oh, but there's a sweet. Good lord, in there. it's, there's. It's, yeah, that's a cedar I'm getting. There's it, Smack it, it really my mama. Is, that's tasty. It's like that first yeah, that pow of flavor from a juicy fruit. That super hit of you know juicy fruit, and then right into smoky peat and wow, it's, it's just still briny like, on but the not, briny. But, but not charcoal. It's not like no. ashy and things. It's more of a like a there, toasted. It's there's so thick. much going on that I'm trying to pick out. Wow. Like, it's got a lot of stuff Man, going on in that glass. Man, is it viscous, too? It's got sweet, it's got brine, it's got, there's peated elements that are just kind of rolling through the Man. whole thing. There's a little green uh, floral note in there. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, it's got, it's very deep and complex. That's right. a very nice It's glass. an odd finish, too. I think it's just briny as well, I'll that, get on That's the finish. cedar I'm getting a finish. Andy, let me have some water, please. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need to. No, no, no. No, we need, we need For power cleaning cleansing. washer. There we go. Water. That's good. We'll come back and water this down. Yeah, I'm not ready to water this down yet. That's a really nice glass. Though. Yes, it is. It, it start the the beginning finish wants to go dry, but it does. It's still, it's it's that's a fun glass. Oh, oh. Mm. this is sweeter. We're on red, right? Yeah, red. Yep, sweeter. Really? No, like uh, like um, sweet. Skittles. Yeah, like Skittles sweet. Oh, that's really fun. Yeah. yeah. Let's, let's slow down a second. Let me yeah, man. Up. That's crazy. Would you have gotten Skittles out of any of those bottles if you looked at them on the shelf? <laughs> no. Super, it is kind no. of like Skittles. I hate to say that. <laughs> well, it's got that like artificial sweetener yeah. kind of thing going on. Mm. Mm. It does, man. Oh, oh it's also. So, uh, thanks. Thank you, Whiskey Across. I get a. For, I get a uh, oh, he's and, got all the same stuff. Or and marshmallows. Same stuff. Man, I'm getting oh, he's wet. Gonna, hey. Awesome. Very cool. We love it when you guys do it. We actually get a lot of comments yeah. that people mm. drink with us on their show that they'll know we're drinking. They'll watch the review or they'll do a live show with us and we'll drink with us. That's pretty cool. So it helps you. I should have probably popped a Benadryl or two before the, tonight, knowing that as much pee as I'm going to be sniffing. There's a chocolate note in so there. It's so sweet. It's got like, it's got sweet tea. Like, sweet <clears throat> iced tea. Like, I'm down south. There's some fruit taste notes, but it's light. Brian mm -hmm. says we should taste the rainbow. Dried bananas. The nose is iced tea. That's a great analogy. I think there's a bit of a cinnamon note or a spice note. Black tea or something on the palate. All spice. Yeah. Ooh, that's hot. It's hotter on the second sip. The first <laughs> sip went down great. Usually that's the one that punches you in the face. So I'm already that's, getting my sinuses are already closing up from the peat that I've been sniffing. So I'm I'm not getting that skittles. I'm almost getting like a wet hay, wet straw. Mm. I don't get the sweetness. Urban, oh, you're not drinking man. anything because it's like three in the morning, dude. We get it, but I I, I, I think you should. Urban, <laughs> it's it's the holidays. Crack open a bottle. Let's, Come on. Call in sick fun. tomorrow. That's, it's all that's, good. That's, Hmm. We'll write you a note for the doctor. in the morning. We got a doctor in the house. Doctor Scott will write Scotch. you a note for work. He's, right? over, there. he's over there waiting. <laughs> right? He's over there. He's got. He's got a. His, yeah. That was pretty cool that he joined you in the show. That was neat to see. Yeah, it was. That was neat that we could do that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, second sip. You said comes in a little hotter. Yeah, more I, honey in the nose I too now. So. Yeah. It's got a lot of sweet things going on in that glass. Mmm. But speed dramming. Mm. You guys are speed dramming. We are speed dramming. I okay. just told me to slow down. I can. I got to drink some water. Like Mr. T. All right. You're on the green. <laughs> Hit the green. That's hot. That's <laughs> really wow. Merry Christmas. Hey. <laughs> Don't mess around. And piss me off. <laughs> you are right, man. Oh, this is green. This is the green. It's orange green. So I'm getting like oh, wet man. blanket. This got, a, this got a little bit of a funky Whoa. Thing it does. Thing going on. This is heavy. It's dark. Do you wash your glass with a detergent? <laughs> it's not nearly as viscous. Um, that, what is that? It's like, it's, it is funky, like a dirty sock. and Yeah, it is. It, well, that tells you what it is. <laughs> it's like a spring bank funk. Not quite that heavy. No, it doesn't, it doesn't feel but, like it's funky. But a, a similar mm -hmm. on the way to... The spring bank. You think Come it's a little around taste the gate? It. Taste like it. something's going bad in the pantry. That's, <laughs> dude, that is the milk funk. 
Totally. Mm. That's that's nice. Oh, that, that's out of Campbelltown. I, get, I don't know what damn, it is. Damn, who put that freaking? Who said blanket? I don't know about that. That's that's gonna be a. This one's lighter though. It, I don't get the depth and complexity that I've that I got out of the first wow. two. At least on the on the first sip. It's, it's got sweet notes and it's got a little <laughs> bit of funk, but the the finish isn't as long. It's got an amazing finish. Like the first part of it, when it hits, it's a little semi sweet, but then that middle palate to the finish is very strong. Dude. Much more subtle of a whiskey. Mm -hmm. Dude, I could drink this all that long. That's delicious. You can put that on. Much that, more subtle of a whiskey. All that long. I think there's a lot more to find in this one right now. Yeah, that keeps some water. Um, hang on a second. Molly's it feels like a, the nose maybe is a lower a ABV a little bit. Oh, there she is. Molly! Molly. Molly. Kerbin, thank you for the $20 or $20, whatever that Molly is. Molly says thank you. Good morning. Appreciate Happy it. breakfast. Merry Christmas. We appreciate it. Appreciate, appreciate you getting up with thank us, thank buddy. You, brother. Thank you very much for supporting us. God, I tell you what, I'm using this. Um, mm. I'm using that. I think this is Lafori. I'm using that Glen Goyne tenure to, to just kind of rinse my palate from the peat. <laughs> it could be because it's, it's, got, it's got a bit of an ashy. And smell it now. It's, it smells like sugar cane. Well, it's so sweet. So this one. It is sugar cane. I don't yeah. find it as, I think it's got some Vanilla. subtle complexity, not in your face complexity like the first right, two. Right, right. But it's an easier drinker. Like I could easily put this glass down and tell but you But you know what? You could drink that every day. There's night. a peat note in there. Oh, absolutely. Oh, there is. I mean, no doubt. But Whiskey Crossing quieter. says he just knows his and Glen Close Scotia sticks out like a crazy with a funk. Yeah. <laughs> yep. I, I think it's, it's got vanilla extract though. I think it's more of a, I think it's more of a Laferig. But I, I don't know. know. The funk on this. So, I, I, if this is the one I pulled the funk on, I'm going to have to keep that in mind. All right. It does get better. It does round out. And I, I like down. it. It's an easy drinking glass, mm -hmm. but. Let me see how we're doing on the um, All right. chicken on the raffle real quick. Actually, let's get through yellow and then, yeah, we'll, and then we'll, we'll do a yellow. We'll, we'll do a raffle water. Or... Hang on. Let me rinse down. Oh, wow. Uh, yellow. So, none of these were what I was Grassy. expecting, really. No. You I know what I mean? Shoot. Okay, so yeah, I, if you right. haven't entered in the raffle, you probably is it, did you close the raffle yet? Not yet. You've got a couple well, more know. minutes. There's there's a, a, a 130 people on. I don't know how many people have entered, and maybe you want to be nice and get a hold of your friends and tell them to hurry up and get in here, or maybe you want to or maybe you want to uh, increase your chances of winning by not telling them. Right. Right. Ron says, "Talk to me, Goose." Uh, well, give me some talk. Well, well, he flew uh, by and he was laughing at us. There it is. It wasn't him laughing. It was me, dickhead. <laughs> Just... Thanks, Ronan. Wow. Very, wow, what's very a, light on the nose. Very, very light. Um, <laughs> this one's sweet. That's a new one. Right? Yeah. Oh, man. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, thanks, thanks, Alex. Thank you. And it's a great comment. Thank you. We appreciate that. Yeah, we are very um, lucky. <laughs> you do have neighbors like us. Every Thursday. Yeah, every, every Thursday, Thursday night. You do. Tune, in. This. Tune in. We're here. We're drinking with you. So, All right. I got to tell you, this this is the one that stands out. I did not get a peat uh, note on this. No. It's um, got a unique this is smell. The, this is the sweeter mm -hmm. of the four, I think. It's very light well, and this, airy. This is like saccharine. So my first nosing was like honeycomb. It had like a, a sweet but not like overly sweet nose to it. No, and right. now it's super floral. Like almost it's perfume. It's a weird combo. It's a weird I combo. Honestly, I'm, not, I'm not getting honey, but I'm, maybe it's floral. But man, this is not a good, not as good. Weird. Like violets or something. I don't know. I mean it, but it's strong. It's almost like uh, caramelized onions mixed with honey or something. <laughs> I don't get that. So uh, you know, I, I know my nose is messed up. My sinuses are messed up from sniffing funny. so much peat. But honestly, you guys are gonna tell me I'm full of crap. I I get a fresh cut cabbage note on the nose. But that's because half of my freaking sinuses, I can't even breathe right now because I've been jamming peat in, in my face. No, actually, that's a good pull. You, you cut it right in half. I mean, that's not bad. It's, yeah. Is there something else there? Holy moly. Because it's not fully sweet. That's perfumey no. and... There is a perfumey part. That's the thing. It's that perfume. Yep. It's almost... What the hell I didn't is that? get it until I took the sip. And then when I went back in and nosed it again, it's all like... Is that the feeling? Like walking thing? through a perfume department where it's just like yeah. overwhelmingly fragrant. Ooh, that's I'm good. I'm not a big no. fan of this one. Oh, it's coming around after yeah, that. Yeah, I wonder if that's Fino coming through. I don't oh, know. Gosh, mm -hmm. maybe water will help it out. Um, all right, yep. And we I'm are already halfway through. I'm going to take a T.O. I'm going to rinse some mouth out here. 
<sighs> All right. I'm going to water mine while it's sitting. Hey, in. Whiskey Mystery. What else you want to talk through tonight? Well, <laughs> don't be afraid of the water. <laughs> don't be afraid of the water. They're yeah. all high ABV, no. so you can do some. None here. of these are going to hurt it. Oh, I need one of these pipettes, too. Yeah, plenty down there. we got to send some. That's what I'm saying. That's okay. what I was asking for. Yep. All right, let's go ahead and uh, while you guys are watering down, let me get the raffle set up and see who our first winner of the night is. All right, we've got, yep, yeah, it's ended. So let's pick a winner. We've got, um, how many? See, how many people? 70, would only 70 people. Out of 140. Out of 142 people. Man. Who, who doesn't want free money? 100 bucks. All right, here's, here's the deal. Let's pick a winner right now, and hopefully everyone will go next time. So here we go. Ready? And Run the roll. winner is. Oh, take it away. <laughs> Boom! Greg, Greg Lewis. Lewis. What's up? We with know that? Greg. Are awesome. You Hi Are you kidding me? Good job, Greg. Nice. So, Man. Greg Lewis, please <clears throat> email us at scotchfordummies at gmail.com so we can take care of that and forward on to our good friends at SMWS and get you a $100 gift card. If you're not a member, you're gonna become a member. And if you are a member, um, hurry up and get out and enter for the US exclusive lottery drawing for the next bottle. And it's a yep. $105 bottle, so there it is. There you go. Five bucks, Five bucks <laughs> plus shipping. <laughs> so that's the beauty of this gift card. Is Look, there he is, woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> so that's the beauty of this gift card is it's, if you're not a member, it doesn't matter because it pays for your membership. Yep. If you are a member, it's a, it's almost a bottle. And it's it's worth it. And it's a good support of the show. Yeah. He sent us a sample not too long ago and we tried it. It was a, well, a blend, it was an older blend, I can't remember now, but uh, that was a really what appreciated was it? bottle. I can't remember. It was not anything that we'd ever had before. It was, was a, yeah, it was a, like a 25 or 35 year old. It was old. Yeah. He found it, so appreciate you, Greg. We're yeah, good. congratulations, Greg. Good good job, man. All right, so two we've SMWSs got, uh, right now. Exactly. Let's, let's do 10 more minutes or so, and we'll start another raffle. Does that right. sound good? Yeah, yeah, that sounds great. Let's work so, through the water. So we've watered Ooh. these down. Do, do we want to uh, rank them now neat? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah, yeah, I'll rank them now neat. And it's tough. It is tough. Shit. Mine's still, I'm good. Green, blue, red, yellow. Blue, green, red, yellow. So, green, blue, red, yellow for me. We can write this down. Blue. There's a post-it note over there. Pen. And I gotta be honest, it's a, it's a neck and neck race on those two horses right now. Blue, green, and green, blue? Yeah, blue, green for me. Mm. Green, Drew is green, blue, red, yellow. Andrew, uh, blue, green, red, yellow. Okay, Sean, I'm doing the same as Andrew. Blue, blue green, green, red, red yellow. yellow. Good you. Uh -huh. I'm doing blue, green, yellow, red. Wow, wow. we're all the wow. stuff for you two. Blue, green, yellow, red. Well, no, well you three all said blue and green. The yeah, same. we just flip the. I mean, so do we have top two and bottom two. So at the end of the day, you got okay. one that's right and three that are wrong. This is easy. Yeah, yeah. 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 All right, so let's taste whatever. The, let's whatever. The water. Let's go yellow to blue. So, right. well, I, I mixed mine around. So give me the order. Yellow, yellow green, red, blue. Yep. Yeah. We're gonna go backwards this time. <clears throat> so we're starting off with yellow. Yellow first. This is watered down. We're getting sweetness on it now. It's still awfully perfumey. Not as bad. Ooh, yeah, I'm getting, I, more, I'm getting more sweet. The honey's now. coming through. Honey yeah, is coming honey, through more. exactly. That is correct. You know what I don't get on this? And I will say, it's a sweeter, more well rounded whiskey now with water on it. It's got a better mouthfeel, but oh. I don't really get. Red hot? Yeah, it's got like a cinnamony, but subtle. Yeah, it's uh, very subtle. It's kind of like after you finish the red hot, but the cinnamon's still hanging yep, out in your yep, mouth. Yep. Um, but it's <laughs> exactly. It's uh, I, I don't get any peat on this thing. Do you? No, no there's not any peat in there. I, no. I gotta tell you, um, I think the water hurt this one. I, I had don't this think at, so. I, I had this at it. my number three, and I really liked it neat. The water brought out a finish that I'm not caring for as much. What are you getting on the finish? That that cinnamon. I didn't get that on the first time. That that spiciness. No, I didn't either. And no. so I enjoyed it without that spiciness. I'm not saying it's bad with the spiciness. Not at all. But oh, Molly! Molly! 
Molly Sims, Dean Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Digging the early Christmas spirit while you enjoy this part. Yeah, Amen so to much. that. Merry Christmas. Yeah, I'm digging we the Molly Sims. I'll even turn the, 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 the lights on for that. We got another one. Hey, Molly. Hey. McNewland, McNewland, six cheers. You know what? Thank I'm not you. gonna waste this. I, I got I, not waste, but I gotta save this for this, the. Uh, the I'm gonna oh, go back to that green. Chat, people. Merry that Christmas. green. Mm. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. It's like barbecue now. Oh my gosh, pork oh, barbecue. Oh yes, so, it is. So green has turned into pork barbecue. Oh, oh my gosh. I, I, I think I know so this one is. So good. That's that smells wonderful. It reminds me of your nachos, Sean. It's. It's like nachos wow. with uh, the, the, the you, sweet and spicy kidding? barbecue sauce. Yep. On Boy, it's in there, isn't it? I smell Man. pork. Man. There's a lot of pork in there. No shit. <laughs> oink, oink. Oh, that is so good right now. That nose is so right good. Wow, well, that, that was my number two. Ooh, that might move up. I think that's Lafroy. Oh, God, that's good. I'm, All right. My money's Lafroy on that one. That's delicious. That is delicious. Wow. Much better. So far, both of mine are better with water. It's good. <laughs> I still, it's got a lighter mouthfeel to it. It's a loss the of the finish is longer, though. Did I lose the Weirdly funk? enough. I don't think so. I think the finish is about the same. Mm. God, I, that's I, good. I, I think, I think to tasty. your point, I think it, it, it <clears throat> punches fast and then grow quick, quickly dies so, down to yeah. the finish. Yeah. 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 It's uh, uh, neat. This was the funky one. Mm -hmm. Yes. Was it really? That's correct. Yes. It was. You didn't get any funk on it. No, I didn't that get funk on it. Nope. Now, man, that is all. Oh, right. I didn't so, get funk in it at all. So that, that that just tells you, you know, that whiskey changed, oh, guys. So oh yeah, it flipped That's over. really good. So that funk may have been that pork nacho trying to get out. <laughs> <laughs> it's that pig fighting to get out the pen. So yellow cinnamon is my off-putting on what that one. What did Jules say? One charming MF and pig. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> Ooh, this is so red. sweet. That red is so sweet. Oh my God, is it candy? God, holy crazy. cow! Dude, what in the world is in this glass? It is sweet. It's really sweet. I mean, the water just turned it into crystal sugar here. It is on the palate too. It is. It's like what eating honey. I can't believe how sweet this is. Oh my gosh, it's crazy. That is nuts. Oh, this is this is changing my whole perspective on all these glasses. <laughs> I know right my now, whole man. order is getting thrown upside hey, down. Hold on. It's it's good oh, though. That's good. But it is it's lost a step on the complexity. So I would I say the red is not my wheelhouse. It is not. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like I like the red. It's just it's too sickly sweet. I'm not a sweet. I mean, I like dark chocolate over milk chocolate every day. It lost a step of its complexity, I think. Okay. It doesn't seem as complex. It does not seem to be the wheelhouse that we were expecting. No. It, it, feel, it feels like Buna. It rolls from oh. super sweet into like eating a spoonful of white pepper. This is red, right? Yeah. yeah. I get a lot of pepper. I get a lot of. It, it's mm. almost spicy on no, the Buna back get, end. It has a chocolate. I'm not getting chocolate on that. No. So not whiskey at all. crossing, you're saying three. What what color is that? I'm so that, sure that's his. That. So he picked. Uh, Green is I don't know three. if he exactly what we had. He likes it. SMB is Buna. Is that his one? Oh, wow. Okay. All He's right. calling them out already. So. Yeah. Um, they want to know which 93 it is. All right, I'm going to blue. All right. Oh, Here we go. Then I'm gonna have some more time. Oh with my these. god, that is so good. Blue. Blue. Holy shit. But that's your wheelhouse right there. That's gotta be. That's gotta be hard <laughs> oh bag. That's gotta be Corey. Has to be. Nothing else is putting out the, the art bag. The... Oh my god, this is like. This is like um, the, the burnt ends on pork. This is like charred meat. Wow. Oh god, that's good. You know what okay, this is? So hold on. Hold this on. is Debo telling you that's his bike, right? <laughs> you think so? $200? <laughs> um, mm. So let's talk about yeah, this for a second. <laughs> so it's a PD shootout. Are we, how are we ranking this? On your specific palate, what you like best, or are we talking about yeah, best what I, peated? What I like best. Okay. There you go. We, should, right, we should not have had um, Buna Hobbit in there if that was it. Yeah, a non peated. We shouldn't have had that. Have let's, had let's, that. let's do, let's do uh, I, mean, I mean, honestly, oh. the, the blue is the best peated so far. I think that's pretty obvious. I, blue, I like the blue. I like the blue best. Overall? Overall. I don't think so. I, I can tell you which. I, I'm already done. I like them all. I, well, I like 
Yellow is my least favorite, but I like them all so far. They're all good. God, those are, that is so nice. I'm going to slam these other three just so I can sit and enjoy this one. All right, I'm going to start the raffle while you guys are talking. All right. Okay, yeah, it's okay. All right. So let's talk about blue. What are you oh, getting on? Oh, yeah. There? Rest in peace, Debo. Yeah, Debo did pass. That's Poor sad, guy. man. It is sad. What are we getting on the, the blue? You want some of this, old man? <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> 39. Okay, cool. Perfect. All right. All right. So, so I'm not disagreeing with you guys that blue's good. It, blue's good, but it's honestly... sweetness. It's so uh, maybe I overwatered it to the point where it's gone. I've lost something, but it's just it, got it's more blue almost. Put in. It, it's more blue. It's got to me. It's got the it's got sweet. Mm -hmm. It's got peat. Mm -hmm. It's got a full bodiedness and a you level know? of complexity that that's what I'm looking for in a peated whiskey. I would agree. The finish, mm -hmm. the mid palate's long. The finish is long. I would venture to say this maybe what Dr. Scott or um, Andrew was talking about. Wow, look at all these eye raffles. With all the aggressive. Bob H? Like, I thought like, you said you were done buying SMWS. <laughs> Bob H. Is he even on? Uh, he's yeah, on. He's I on. saw his eye raffle. Quiet going, tonight. I know he is he's, being. He's sneaking. Bob, is he alive? Oogie, oogie, oogie. I thought he it's froze to death sitting around a fire in the snow oh, the other night. I'm make like, sure you put exclamation point raffle. Yeah, not just raffle, exclamation point. So everybody, go through your your rankings one more time and spend some time. Yeah, I, I don't know yet. I'm, I'm done. I'm good. I'm ready. I'm 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 not I'm ready. ready. Uh, we'll write this down. Here, right. I'm ready. If you guys are ready, go ahead. Here. All right. I'm probably the same as Andrew. What are you doing? Blue, green, red, yellow. I am. Oh, I switched. Did you? Interesting. So I am. Blue, green, yellow, red. So my red and yellow flipped with water. You guys ready? Are you good? No, no, not All yet. Right. All right. Speed dramming. Speed dramming. I love speed dramming. <laughs> I'm, I'm slowing down. So these shirts are available on scotchfordemonies.com. Boy, I tell you what, though, when you add Pete into the it, it's, it slows the... No, not, not the hose shirts. <laughs> it's slow. The uh, uh, speed dramming shirts. <laughs> You know, we could raffle, we could raffle this. this is one of a kind. It's one of a kind. I'll bet it is. I mean, how many shirts do you know that do this? That, that was pretty good, Sean. Good timing. I don't know. Is it's a, festive as hell, man. Are those black lights? <laughs> <laughs> oh. And, and I've got holes oh. cut. I've got holes Wait, cut right listen, here. Listen. I don't know. I watch a lot the, of crime shows. Keep the rails on. We're not off yet. Come on. We're getting close. I'm off the rails. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, I'm really liking three. The green, I like it a lot, but I, I it does not. It's hard to compete against number one, and I, I like the sweetness of red. I mean, it's they're all three good. They're like different categories. Exactly where I'm at. Yep. I really am appreciating the green. I love the sweetness of red. Can't disregard the the, the wonderfulness of blue. Unfortunately, Pick yellow doesn't have a fight in this no. this this ring. I mean, I just finished my yellow, and it's good. But it's not it's not the same as the other ones in, in this lineup. I mean it's a peated it's a it's a peated shootout. And, and unfortunately two of them didn't really qualify. That's no yeah. You know. yeah. All right. I don't I don't all right me. Hang on a second. I'm I'll get there. I I don't know. I'm stuck. All right. I'm stuck. Andrew and I will just talk about it for a while. You guys just keep I'm talking. Ready. You're already you're already I'm ready. All right, what do you you have? <laughs> Again, I really like blue, green, and red for their own uniqueness. I really do. It's so I, it's hard to compete against all these. My my personal Pick palette, I I would where I am in my palette right now, I would go to red. However, tonight's showcase is peated, and I'm going with blue. That's okay. number one. Okay. And then I'm going green, okay. red, and then yellow. Although if you poured, well, I'd actually I'd drink any of them. But if you, well, I'm gonna I, drink all four of them. If I oh, were, yeah. if I was, a, if I was at, you know, we were we were shooting some people at night. I, I would go for the red. But red's not peated, is it? Mm -hmm. But I, it but is. That's, but but he's I like drinking. Right that's now. what I'm. My palate's at. But I, I, I appreciate what we have yeah. here. Yellow is not. I don't know what yellow is. I, I let me go ahead on record and state this. I think Ardbeg blue. Um, I think Buna is red. Laphroaig is yellow, and I guess this would be the. Um, Nova Scotia, green. So you guys are getting no peat on yellow? No. 
No. Nope, there's no Pete there. Mm -mm. But I'm really torn on, on how, how I, I don't want to dethrone blue, but I'm ready to. Really? Dethrone blue? Yeah. yeah. Hmm. So what do you got? You going green? I'm going green. Wow. See, I, I'm I'm not far. I mean, I'm right there with you. But like green, red, blue, yellow, and and I'll be honest with you, it, it, when these three, the green, red, and blue, it's a mood thing. It, it, yeah, right, it really right, is. Right now, I I might go this way, and tomorrow we could be sitting on your deck around a fire, and I want this one. I these are. All three have their own things. I'll give it to you. Red is an oversweetness. I kind of enjoy it. Is Honestly, it so I'm sitting sweet? here drinking the red right now going, this is actually pretty right. good. Right, so glass, right? I, I, it's, it's really tough. It's really fine lines, but it's fine lines. They're all unique. They're not the same in, in any way, shape, or form. So it really comes down to, I just can't make my it's mind tough. up which one I love more. It's tough. I like all three profiles here. Yep. Um, so I'm just gonna go, and I'm just gonna do this just to do it. I, otherwise, I'm gonna sit here all night, and they're gonna they're gonna be I'm, going I raffle. I raffle. I'm with you, actually. I I, I appreciate what you have there. All right. Yep. So we have Drew with blue, green, red, yellow. We have Andrew with there. blue, green, r yellow, red. So I'm flipping these two. We have Sean with. Blue, oh, yeah. green, red, yellow. So we're the same. Yep. And we have Mark with green, red, blue, the bottles. yellow. The bottom top these off. With the so question: Can you compare the first ones, the, the <clears throat> before water? Is there, uh, any, is there big differences, or are they, are they flipped? Sean didn't change. So nope. you're, you stayed the same. Okay. Uh, I flipped my red and yellow, you my did. three and four. So you put red last. He did in this, on the, on the at, final with water. On yes. final with water, you put red last. Okay, cool, cool. Um, Drew, I flipped a lot. No, he only you Drew only flipped. No, nah, that's not true, Sam Ham. Oh, really? You got a chance? So, yeah. so you, had, you had green, blue, red. Oh, yellow. you're right. I did. Yeah, you yeah. got a way better chance of winning this than the Powerball. So Mark, yeah. <laughs> Mark moved his blue from number one to number three. I, I did the switcheroo. I he did the one number, two. He moved his number four to number two. The red moved up from number. You switched four. a lot, yeah. man. I'm telling you, water played the bunkerama. All right, but yellow was in those sciences. And those, I man, <laughs> you know, I honestly, uh, and we had let's, company, or I would have. Let's expose this. Let's, let's expose one. So number so, one, blue is the number one. Let's, let's do yellow. Let's do yellow. Let's do yellow. Oh, okay, yellow. Well, so uh, yellow. Yeah. Yet no one liked yellow. But let first of all, I had a three. yellow. I don't. I don't know that it was not liking. It, it just didn't fit the profile. Yeah, so, so what do you think it is? I, I think, for, without a doubt, it's the SMWS Bunnehaven. Um, the 10 dot. Mm, no, I don't think so. Oh! Really? This is the Glen Scotia? 91.119. That's exactly what I thought it was. Wow! Huh? How can, how can, how can, oh, okay, I, I'm not going right. to so, question. Right. So is that, is, is that Springbank Funk a barreling issue? Issue? A, an aging issue? I just think that it's, that's just our best I, attempt. I don't know if the funk is an issue. It's an absolute delicious dram. It doesn't belong in the lineup when it comes to peat. No, I finished it first. Red is Buna. Red is. Really? What do you guys think it is? Well, I thought, which was that what we're going next? Red? Yes. All right, what red. What do you think it is? Mm -hmm. I don't even know. It's it's the sweetest of them. So what do we have left? Or the Lafroy. No, it's not SNW. Is it? SNWS. Which one is it? Buna. It's Buna. 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 Yeah. All right. All right. That was my so, Bunahaven is red. S, uh, Glen Scotia is yellow. Those are the two SMWSs. Now it comes down to green this is Lafroig. Telling you, has to be. Yeah. And well, go for go for green. I'll, I'll hold the the, the number one. Everybody picked blue. <laughs> green you didn't is. Pick blue. I, well, I mean, you guys picked blue. I was going to pick green. No way! I had him backwards. Green Holy is hard crap. bag. Hard bag. Corey Vrack. Who went with really? Corey Vrack in number serious? one? This guy. What is this? Which green means, is the hard bag. Corey Vrack. That's awesome. Which means your blue is your Lafroy Karchis. Um, Man, that's, that's awesome. so good. You know, you know who's going to be happy about that? Zach Andrews. I'm not upset about any of that, man. You know, you, I mean, there's nothing to be upset about. I mean, in all honesty, wow. I am. Right. That's interesting. I man. am shocked about the 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 display of the the Glen Scope. So maybe I need to think back when we first nosed them Oof. neat. 
Which one, one had the most funk? Oh, do you? Oh, I'm getting Which one had the most funk? Gerben says, I told you. The the most, the most funk, funk was red. Yeah. Funk? No. No. I yeah. Yellow would. Mmm. Now we're gonna have to go back and watch the video again. <laughs> I don't remember. What was Doctor funk Scratch was. in this one? I don't. I don't think I, I didn't have any funk actually. One of them was funky. He, you yeah. you guys said yellow was funk. I thought. So no, blue, you said you said green was funky. What you guys? Said. Blue was the Lafroy. Which was Ardbeg, right? Green was Ardbeg. Blinds are awesome, Brandon. I, I, I nailed the Buna and the yellow for sure. So, I had these backwards. Advice to everybody watching that's never wow. done a blind. The first thing you have to do going into <clears> it <throat> is just accept the fact that you're not going to be right. There's no right or wrong. You're not the one that's on the target here. Well, you are going to be right. Well, yeah, exactly. You, know? you, you are always right. There yeah. is no wrong. I mean, yep. people wow, get so amazing. worried about it. Oh, I'm going to get beat up. <laughs> Blinds, blinds expose all that, man. It's all about the whiskey, man. So it's it's interesting and it's so educational and you learn so much about your palate and the whiskey. So yep. uh, So the, the arguable winner, they're all winners. Put that to the camera. But the arguable winner, everybody chose this guy except for me and I went so with the... So talk to me about readiness. Is this Is this something you can get? I mean... Uh, not this one not anymore. anymore. No, that no was this over. was last year's offering. Yeah, last. But the Karchis has been around for a while. They so do Lafroy do does uh, a Karchis offering every year. Every year, every year. Right. And Lafroy is normally. Mm -hmm. and let's talk about Peter for a second. Lafroy is normally more of the medicinal, iodine, no, iodine. They're charcoal. Ardbe or um, Lafroy is like charcoal with their peat. Mm, okay, so okay. I, I Ardbeg think it's more, would be an Ardbeg iodine. is more iodine. Most. Okay, well, medicinal. Well, anyway, so Lafroy has your uniqueness to it, where Ardbeg is as well. But <laughs> it's creosote, yeah. Creosote, whatever. I yeah. think it's medicinal, but whatever. Yeah, I mean, Lafroy 10 is known for being a band aid. Yeah, correct, yes. Yeah, okay. Right. So, but this is not so much that. No, it has none of those notes. <laughs> no. <laughs> exactly. No, it doesn't. That, that right. Fino. Like, that Fino. Oh, Greg Lewis, Greg Lewis again, is like, you. hey man, you, I want to say thank you. Thanks, no, buddy. Greg won. He's a big winner tonight. Good I love to you, Molly. Greg. She's awesome. I, it's good to see her. Quick, quick uh, update. We have eight exactly eight minutes left. We have seventy-seven people. Don't that be late. Have hit raffle. We have one hundred and fifty-four people watching. So, so what do you win? hundred dollar gift card. Hundred dollar gift card to the That's, SMWS. It's our last one, right? Last one. So, At least quite right interesting. I think um, I'm surprised to see that the Bunahaven fared as well as it did because pull that Bunahaven out. It's an SMWS, and according to the SMWS profile, there's no peat. Yeah. This isn't a peated offering. Oh, down here. Right, this is not a peated offering of Bunahaven. But it was a fuller body. Charcoal? No, that's the Glen, that's the Glen Scotia. That's, yeah, that's my Western Wanderer, right? Yeah, yeah. Western Wanderer, ten dot one sixty seven, um, eleven year old, fifty nine point five. Man, it's sweet as all get out. I just had a glass. Yeah, it's really it, good. It's it's heavy on the sweetness. That's for sure. If you got a sweet yeah, tooth, good. you like you you're gonna like it. Um, interesting bottle, and I'm I'm pleasantly surprised to see it fare well in this lineup. Agreed. Well, no, I, it didn't fare well. It felt uh, well. I, it, third it, or fourth. I, I rated mine more on the peated lineup. I mean, I I actually was with you more in the line with my palate. I, I I would actually go for red and green first before I go for blue. Ooh. Right now, because I'm not a huge peat lover right now. I, I appreciate I it. Know, I like all of them. <laughs> yeah, I like all of them. But I mean, honestly, I've been drinking a hell of a lot more sherry bombs in my mm -hmm. bar right now than anything. Blue I got a fire. ton of, of of peated that are unopened because yep. I'm just not in the mood to open them. Yep. Um, I keep reaching for the sherry. I don't know. Uh, Sam Ham says, Buna is the king of sleeper drams. I absolutely could not agree more. Yep. It really is. Well, it, and you know what? That's it's always fun. there to say, hey, I'm not dead. Don't, don't forget about me. That's what's fun about the SMWS, because you have an idea in your head about that distillery and what that bottle's going right. to taste like, and you're better off just reading the... Uh, yeah, the descriptors because it's not going to be what you think it is. Honestly, I mean, it's a hundred bucks a year for a membership, and you can buy a couple bottles. They're a little expensive, but good lord, I mean, I've got like twenty bottles. Way more like. than you need. <laughs> and, and more than I need. They're delicious. I've not had one bad bottle, and you're not going to go wrong. I mean, high ABV, you can right. play around with it, and great distilleries. See what you come up with. So yeah. <laughs> 
Um, oh, man, they're all good. Uh, all good. What else we got? It's our last well, show, it is man. our last show. Let's, uh, let's do a rundown of 2020. What was... Uh, I know we had some bummers in 2020, right? We were supposed to be going to Scotland. That was a major, and that was a huge disappointment. Bummer. So June of this year, we were all supposed to go. We had we had it all taken care of. It was done. Bus was loaded. Yep. Everything ready to go. We had the tour laid out, guys. Yep. I mean, for all of you that, that actually ponied up money for the the deposit, right? I mean, yeah. how many people did we have that, that, that committed? But uh, yeah. but we're gonna have a fun announcement on our patron after show. Maybe, yeah. There's, there's actually. Let's. I mean, to to parlay, we'll parlay that here in a second for the 2021 conversation. Mm -hmm. To wrap up 2020, we came into the year like a lion with big plans. We we really did. We had, and we started off with Kill Karen, which is I, kind our of first one review of the year. Really, really kind arguably, of pretty much yeah. was arguably. And we called it out. Crazy. And with plans to be in Scotland. I mean, in June we were like, supposed to be in Scotland with we're twenty roll. of you, and um, we had we had plans. I mean, we had distilleries lined up. It was going to be an epic, epic adventure, and to to have that all shut down, to have well, pretty much all of our lives shut down. I mean, honestly, for the first time in our five years, we literally separated and started doing virtual live shows from our homes. Which and isn't as much fun. Hell no, it's not Never. as much fun. I mean, it, we you, if you guys go back to the first year, you know what we're about. We're about the four of us to get together. We talked about it earlier. What, what brought us together was getting together and having a glass of scotch and throwing darts. Right yep. here. You know? Yep. yep. So it. It, that, that sucked. But... We all, we, we, you know, we, we made it. through it. We, we're here. You're here, which is absolutely oh, most important Molly. to us. Molly's here. What's going on, Molly? So killed. Oh, so killed. Dream, 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 man. Thank you, Cheers brother. to 2020. Yep. Yes. Thanks, buddy. Let's put 2020 to rest. So, I mean, to, to wrap 2020 up, I know that these three guys are okay, healthy, and safe. I, I, I hope and pray that you guys are. And you, I, I just want everyone to have a Merry Christmas. You put this behind us, and I don't. Let's just hope and pray that uh, come twenty twenty one, things change. Because we're not yeah. giving up on the trip to Scotland. We're not giving up on our no, anniversary. We not. We're not yeah, giving we up. We missed on our five years. <laughs> listen, listen, the fire has started. We're just getting going. And that's the that's yep. the guy's honest truth. Yeah. If you guys look at Scotch for Dummies numbers and where we're going, uh, we're things are, are starting to crank and. We're we're only gonna double down. We, we're gonna we got a lot of stuff going on. We're gonna we get that vaccine tastings. and we're gonna whiskey um, tastings coming up. We got a freaking restaurant we're, yeah. we're working on. We've got well, I won't give all the special no, ingredients no, away. We'll save, but, we'll save uh, a few we, things, we've got but. some pretty magic. So some cool stuff in the works for us. We got some great video ideas. We got some behind the scenes. We've got even people that we're investing in to help us with social. I won't call them Michaels. This will be your scotch out. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> But I mean, things are going well. We're, we're improving, so I, I love it. It's great stuff. And we've got some opportunities on the forefront for 2020, 20, uh, 21. So, yes, we are definitely still trying to figure out some kind of gathering for an anniversary. Yeah, because we, we really want to do something. Yeah, no. six years is going to be. I mean, big Indianapolis. Yeah. Some, you know, we're we're going to host something where y'all are invited to come into to our hometown here and, and share a couple nights with us doing something, whether it's pairings, dinners. We're going to drink some all scotch. That. All that. <laughs> and, all that. And above. We still are looking at 2021 20, for Scotland. Probably late for that. I don't know. I, I think that's probably going to be 2020. We're not but, done with it. We're yeah. not putting Scotland away, obviously. I mean, that's that's the Mecca. That's the homeland. I mean, we're, we're looking to buy property there, for God's sake. <laughs> um, <laughs> True. So you want to open a distillery? <laughs> Go fund me here. No. <laughs> right. And the, the final thing is, is we, you know, in 2020, the uh, Scotch for Dummies uh, are minor investors in this guy's <laughs> new restaurant. <laughs> and uh, wait for Molly. Uh, I'll, I'll wait for Molly because we're going to talk about it. So, but with, with the advent of having Sean's new restaurant, it, it opens up the doors for Scotch for Dummies to do some dinner tastings yep. and to do some fun events. And to and have that guy come down. Yeah, and, and to stuff. have that guy right there that, that, that's getting ready to super chat us that, that comes across our screen before you guys see it. And to, I mean, there's there's opportunity to get back into what we've done before. When, yeah. when you were at Which the other love. restaurant, we, we love how that much, stuff, man. Man. So, I mean, yeah. I'm I'm uh, cooking all the time. Man, cooking, cooking, cooking. all kinds cook of stuff it. going on. So, there are, the, and, and guess what? We've talked about it in the there last couple of years. Wait a minute. Molly. There it is. 
Thanks, Ben. Ben, we Thanks, like brother. Ben. First of all, it's good to see you, brother. I texted you just because I haven't heard from you. I want to make sure you're okay. I want to make sure your ladies were okay. You have two of them in your life now, and I know it keeps Lady you busy. Yeah. Hey, so, and, and speaking of Ben, we have 25 seconds left for our, ne our last and final SMWS gift card. So we gave another one away tonight. We're giving two away tonight, Ben, because this is our last live of the uh, 2020 year. Yep. So, Can you believe it? We made it. Yeah, got it. it is kind of crazy. We but it. it was a weird year, man. It is a weird year. But we talked about a lot of opportunities, and the final opportunity was it was maybe the Scotch for Dummies isn't done giving up trying to get a barrel of whiskey. And oh, we're working yeah. on it. You know, I'll just put it out there like that. A little teaser. There's maybe more to say about There's it. There's something coming up, y'all. We just want to share that. Coming up. We got to share I'll that with our patrons, it. the people so, that keep so the So if we on. were to create a bottle, you think people would like it? I don't know. Maybe. I do Just want to buy a distillery and find out. I can guarantee you <laughs> we're not putting Scotch for, Dummies na uh, Scotch for Dummies name on a bottle that uh, we, we haven't like. approved yeah. and stamped damn good. <laughs> See, I, right. I feel like, uh, you know, you roll that sherry butt in and we're like, well, we got to taste it some more. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We, were, we only more. got 130 bottles out of that whole butt. You I hope that? this guy hasn't been on a fishing <laughs> trip with us. <laughs> I hear Molly. Well, let's uh, let's get Ben in here and, and put him. What's in Molly? Molly's yeah. on last. So Molly, what? We just yeah, had somebody Molly. super chatted us. What? Oh, we did. Richie Z. Oh man, we're Cheers, working man. through these. Thank Richie. you. Yeah. Thank you, Richie. Yeah, thank you. Very Merry much. Christmas, man. Happy holidays to you. Uh, to everybody, I'm glad that we're seeing yeah. everybody here. Here goes the winner. Drum roll the for the last. Final winner of 2020 100 SMWS gift 100 card is... Oh, you can see it. Whiskey I love it. Man. Brand new Patreon like a couple weeks ago. Thank yeah. you so much for supporting us. There you us. go, man. Thank I'm you. I'm telling you, if you're not Patreon, it's like five bucks a month. Come on, So folks. much fun behind the scenes. You get to hang with us behind the scenes. He's yeah, been commenting sure. all night. Just uh, This is awesome. I love the awesome. interaction. Hey, I Thank wanted you. to say I see Rob from Canada up there, that Canadian guy. Canadian that guy. guy. What's, What's going on? Good Whiskey see him, six, man. man. He should join us on our uh, Zoom call. That dude, yeah, he, he should, should join our live show, our post live show on our Zoom call so we can, can catch we, up can we with him. Bring him, him in? It's been yeah, a minute. Yeah, let's bring him yeah. in. You're doing it, Rob. I don't care if you have to teach tomorrow or not. You're <laughs> off. <laughs> call the boss. We're all working tomorrow. Oh Maybe gosh. not you. Guys, I don't want to end the show, but we kind of have to. Yeah, that's awesome. I that's am. awesome. Yeah, well, that's a whiskey. That's a great way to go out, man. That's awesome, dude. So, all right, let's recap, you guys. Next week is obviously Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. Eve. Um, we're not doing it because we all have family obligations. Thank yep. God that we do. Um, and then the following week is New Year's Eve. Correct. Which Sean's I'm working. This guy said he's sure. working. You're I'm, out of I'm town. I'm in St. Louis for more than likely. Um, yeah. But we are we are shooting some reviews. And hopefully, we'll have next Monday and the following Monday recorded so we can post stuff. But no live shows. No live shows at this point. Maybe there will be impromptu live we'll see you know, off the phones just to see no what what people are doing. But only to patrons. Or, right. or patron Zoom or something like yeah, that. Yeah, patron Zooms, just to see how people are doing and hanging in there, what they got for Christmas, what kind of special bottles. But oh, at the God. end of the day, this is our okay, last so. live for 2020, officially. Um, Let's put this one in the books, man. <laughs> now, I hate to, 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 to cut it off with everybody, but I do want to put 2020 in the books, man. I didn't. This one pissed me you off. You know what? <laughs> I just want to say, with we, you. we got through it, we made it work, but screw you, 2020. Yeah, my wife actually ordered some some Christmas ornaments that look like snowflakes, and when you look in closely, it says F U C K twenty twenty. That's appropriate. So I like my guys, gift to you guys better. Yeah, I ran to that. <laughs> All right, guys, listen. Uh, so, it's been one hell of a year. I'm gonna go out with this number blue. Hang on, I got whiskey blue. crossing. The only one I got left. Email us scotchfordummies at gmail .com. We need your email address so that we can forward it on to Mister. Uh, ben Dietrich uh, at SMWS and finish and out our, our SMWS giveaways that we're <laughs> so grateful that he allowed not, us to do. Not a bad way to end of the year. No, it's a great way to end of the year. And if you're not an SMWS member, hurry up and get one so you can get into the raffle due by Monday. Good yeah. stuff. Can't go wrong with it. Love you guys. guys. All right, guys. guys. Cheers. We'll see you guys. Patrons. Happy New Year. Just Merry Christmas. See ya.